guys. Okay, so my name's Mylene, and this is my first video. And I'm super uber excited because I've been really wanting to do this for a while. Um, and I figured why not start with a haul. So I actually got a bunch of stuff from e.l.f. Because I've like never gotten anything from there before. And I've watched so many videos on YouTube about how their products are so amazing. And how they're almost like high-end products. And they're super, super cheap. So I figured why not. Um... So I actually just got this like a few days ago um, and I got, I want to say, 16 or 17 items and I paid, how much was it, like 20 something bucks? I don't know, it was really cheap and it was pretty awesome because I got a lot of stuff for it. Um, okay, so starting off, I got this lipstick, what is it in, in Flirtatious. And it's in this color. I don't know if you can see it. Um, it's really, it's like a light pink. I thought it was really cute because I usually don't really wear light pinks. And I don't know. I usually wear like bright reds, bright pinks, like out there colors. I don't know. So I figured I might like something a little bit more natural. I've actually heard that these lipsticks aren't that great because they're kind of like waxy feeling. And they look cute on your hand, but... When it comes time to apply it, it doesn't really look that good, but hey, I haven't tried it yet, so I'll have to let you know about that. Um, and then I think I got another one in the same, these were these were a dollar. I think these are the ones that people were saying weren't that great. Um, this one is in Gypsy. And that's that. Color on the bottom, I think it's really pretty. It's very like, not subtle, but a little bit less subtle than you know, the brighter colors that I wear. Um, and then I just got a bronzer because, I mean, the bronzer that I usually use is like this like Avon one. And I don't even know why I have it because I don't even really use Avon, but it's this one and it's all like crusty looking and it's like I've hit the pan on it and it's just blech. I don't know. And it's very glittery and I'm not a very glittery kind of person, but I've worn it a lot. So uh, I guess it must be okay. Um, and this one I feel like it, it's a, it's pretty glittery. Um, I haven't used it yet, but on the back of it, it says that it complements all skin tones. So we'll see about that one. Um, well, let me hold on. Let me swatch it for you. Ooh, it looks like an eyeshadow, like super glittery and I don't know. We'll see. We shall see. Um, I got a lip stain. Because I absolutely love lip stains because, I mean, my big thing about lip stain is that it's like you don't have to really worry about it so much and it's like, I don't like having to reapply lipstick all the time. And I know you have to reapply lip stain too, but I don't know, I just kind of like throwing it on and not having to worry about like eating something and then your lipstick gets all over something or, I don't know, it's just, it's just better that way. Um, this one is really light because I wanted something a little bit natural. You're probably not even going to be able to see this, but it's the one like all the way at the top. And I actually swatched it when I first got it and it didn't come off for like the whole day. So that's a good sign. Um, but I haven't actually worn it on my lips yet. Now I got this e.l.f. Zit Zapper. Don't know if you can see it. Um, I got it because I saw a review on it and people were like, oh, you know, it's really great. You just pop it right on and, you know, the next thing you know, it's like fading away. Um, I mean, I get pimples every now and then and I figure why not just try it. I think it was pretty much almost a dollar. Oh, by the way, most of the stuff I showed you, if anything, all of the things I've showed you so far, they were all a dollar. So, I mean, it's worth a shot. It's a dollar. Why not just try it? You know, um... Where is, actually, let me read the back of this thing. Oh, okay. It says, Zap zits away with the unique blend of salicylic acid, which is basically when you read, like, all of the other, like, face washes and all that stuff that's all on there, too. Um, tea tree, witch hazel, and camphor. Hmm, okay. Instantly beautiful, healthy-looking skin. All right, well, we'll see. I mean... I don't know, it feels, let's see what it feels like. 
kind of just feels a little bit sticky. Smells a little weird, so maybe that's good. Don't know. But I'll definitely get back to you guys on that one. Um, okay. Uh, I got, I think this is the eyebrow lifter and filler. Um, because basically what I'm using for my eyebrows is just eyeshadow, which, I mean, that's not bad. That's, it's, it's cool. But, um, I was gonna say awesome. I mean, that's whatever. Um, but I figure a pencil is better. I actually got a pencil not that long ago. It's this Master Shape Maybelline, Master Shape Maybelline thing. And, okay, total ripoff because I paid like $8 for it. And it only came with just the little tip part. Like, it didn't even... Okay, wait, is it coming up? Don't tell me it's coming up, because that's not cool. No. Like, this is it. It's just the little tip, and then that's it. Like, rip off. And I just used a little spooly thing. But I actually, that's one of the things I bought, so I won't have to use that anymore. But anyway, okay, so I got a pencil. This one is in... Does it tell you the color? I think it's just dark and ivory, I believe. Not sure. But, uh... I'm not sure. Um, so f I figured this would be, you know, obviously for like under, you know, under your brow and then you could even use this as like a, a, a waterline liner because sometimes it's nice to have like a natural color and then, you know, this one's for your eyebrows. And it comes with a little sharpener on it, which I think is really awesome. It's convenient. Um, what is this for? Oh, right. This thing. Okay. So that's that. And then I got one of the cream liners because somebody recommended this very very highly recommended this and I figure I don't have a purple one so why not get a purple one um it's actually like very small like it doesn't come like there's not it gives the illusion that there's a lot but it's not really a lot I believe that this was probably like three bucks I don't think it was a dollar I think it was three dollars but I mean it's that bottom one I mean it looks pretty nice we'll see I'll play around with it see how it goes um, uh, I do like the packaging though. I think it looks really cute. Um, okay. Moving on. I'm probably going so slow right now. Hello. Okay. And then I got the Tone Correcting Concealer. Now, I can't remember if this was the one that people were saying isn't all that great that when you like put it on and blend it, it just like disappears. But, um, I got this for like under my eyes and, you know, for little spots here and there. But... It seems like, I mean, it matches, I think this is an ivory. Oh, no, sorry. It's in light beige. And, um, I mean, you probably can't even see it. It's right here. And it blended in pretty nicely, so it's not like it disappeared. I can see that it's there, but at the same time, it blends really nicely. That was a dollar. Um, I got a pair of lashes because I never get lashes. Like, I've never actually, well, I mean... I've worn them, but like for like a special occasion or something, never to just like go to school or like go out. But um, they were a dollar, and I figured why not just try them out. Um, I think the ultimate test would be to like, like if they were actually really good, would like to see if I peel it off. If I if I peel it off and like the lashes come off, then that's never a good sign. But if they don't, then that's good. And it looks to me like it's coming all off, so good worth a try um yeah and then with these I might just like cut these in half and then just use like one for like the little end because I love the way that looks like with the little fluttery piece and like you have like a wing and it looks really cute okay anywho and then the last things that I got were just brushes because I mean you never can have enough brushes um this one is an e.l.f. brush, and when I first felt this, I was like, oh my god, I want to put it all over my face. Like, it's just so soft, and like, you just want to cuddle with it, basically. Um, the ones that are black, I believe, are $3. And then all of the brushes, oops, this is not a brush. This is, um, whatever, I'll tell you about that later. Hold on. Okay. All the ones that are white are a dollar. Um... This one is just an eyeshadow brush, which you can never have enough of those, and it's only a dollar, so why not? Um, and especially because I like to have eyeshadow brushes for light colors and then for the darker colors, because then when you use a dark color and then you put a, white, a lighter color on top of it, no bueno. Okay. And then a spoolie, told you earlier, because I don't want to use that crusty little thing anymore, and it's pretty thick and nice, and 
why not dollar um this one's a smudger and I know it kind of seems like a waste of money because you could just kind of use your finger but I don't know I kind of liked it because I like when you have to get underneath your eye and like just kind of like smudge it out and sometimes I think I have a liner that actually doesn't smudge like with my finger for some reason it doesn't want to budge so maybe this will help it out we'll see um but yeah those were a dollar this was three dollars and then the last thing that I got was a white eye widener pearl white eyeliner um and it comes with a little sharpener on it which I think is awesome and it's just you know I love the look underneath you know the waterline or whatever and it opens up your eyes and I mean let me see hold up hold up and it comes off really awesome so excited to use that I hope you can see that yeah alrighty um so I mean all in all I would recommend it just to try it out I'm I'm gonna like actually wear the products now because I totally like got this box this big old ginormous thing and I was like man I'm gonna have to wait until I film and then I can't use my products and so now I'm gonna be able to actually use them I don't even know why I didn't use them just because I wanted it to look nice and presentable for you guys um but now I'm actually gonna use them and then I'm gonna do a video where it's like the best and the worst um and then definitely you know comment below the products that maybe you have that you really like or the things that that I bought that you know or like hits or misses for you um but yeah that's basically it so um until next time um I oh I think I'm actually gonna do an outfit of the day for today because I don't know I got a lot of comment com compliments on my outfit today so I figure why not um I might do those a lot so my boyfriend's camera died on me. So anyway, like I was saying, um, I was rambling on and on and on and on, and you probably don't want to hear that. But anyway, I was trying to say that I'm going to be doing the um, outfit of the day. Um, and basically, that was pretty much it. And I just wanted to thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I appreciate it, and I'm so going to enjoy doing these videos. I'm going to try to be doing them um, on Fridays and Sundays. And I know that's kind of close together, but... I might do it like maybe I might separate out separate it out a little bit um I'm actually in the school play right now so hopefully things don't get chaotic but it's okay because yeah but anyway all right <laughs> um okay so thank you guys so much for watching and um have a nice day guys bye Baby! Bye. How do I know when it's recording?